Well, I'm there, Reuters. G'day mates, happy Friday, it's Trump and Monkey. We just got off another raging juice laggy stream. Gotta break the news to you though. DRC, this is the Fitty who's dropping today. In case you missed it, a lot of people rolled through chat, so I'm sure you missed the GMM. Maybe you didn't, you just want to hear my voice again. DRC is coming. Obviously gets a Raiders cams and a bunch of other teams. Uh, including um, Giants, I know, are in there. Obviously Cards are in there as well. Pretty... What a... No, that, that's all I can remember off the top of my head. Look it up, though. Have a looksy wooksy. DRC is going to be crazy fast. Crazy good coverage. For me, Nomdi Asim was the best corner in the game this year. However, he just makes the most plays for me. Not the same for everybody, but DRC is going to be up there as well. Looking pretty freaking incredible. However, you might have missed. You might have missed, right? You might have missed right here. We don't want to go full screen. Gets a little buggy sometimes when we go full screen. Steve Hutch, who blocked for Sean Alexander, who we got earlier in the week. This is going to be your best left guard in the game, okay? Gold standard left guard. Interesting that they went with, um, like, just a regular dude in his regular position here. I wouldn't have put Steve Hutch as, like, a game-breaking... I wouldn't have thought any O-lineman really was that game-breaking. So it's kind of interesting that they put him in the 50. Obviously, super freaking awesome left guard. Uh, go Seahawks. And then we called it. We actually predicted this. We predicted Brett Favre. The throw power is insane. The throw power is going to be so crazy. Powered up 94. Go deep and, and like some Packers chems. He's going to have 99 throw power on some teams. Um, which is just crazy. So I can't wait to see him. Nobody knows what his archetype is yet. We'll find out in about an hour or so. I think it's probably going to be um, strong arm. But... I'm with Gut Fox. Should be improviser. It would be pretty rad, right? But obviously the speed is is a little bit slow. But still, Brett Favor in the game. I really enjoyed using him a few years back. I'm really glad he's coming to Mutt. I'm glad we got the prediction right. That's absolutely freaking awesome. Now then, of course, we had the team standouts drop today. And we'll have a quick run through each of these for you right here. Um, Carful, I, I love these guys, by the way. I think I think there's some really good budget options in there. Really, really good budget options. Kyle Fuller with the 90 speed and the 89 zone. Really nice. William Jackson, 91 speed. Solid. Josh Allen, nice and fast. Crazy throw power as well. Uh, Justin Simmons, probably, like, I love the height. Love the zone. Probably just fast enough when it comes to the speed on a theme team. It'll be great. Kareem Hunt, super respectable. Remember, they got Chubb as well from the Derwin versus the World the, uh, stream. So, so you got, like, a couple of 90 running backs there for, for the... For the brownies, brownie the elf. Um, now, obviously, 93 finesse move, but this is a mech card for me. Too slow at left outside linebacker, and I've seen 99 finesse move do nothing on TJ Watt. Now, Kyler Murray, I was just watching Gut Fox play with him. Really, really sick. Really, really awesome looking item right here. Um, seriously, crazy good throw power with crazy good speed. I love the look of it. Director will be happy with Eckler, a theme team running back. That's about it. Now, Sneed, though, with 92 speed and 6-1 and solid coverage stats really solid potential starter on a Chiefs theme team right there. Darius Leonard finally did him good on the speed. Really, really solid looking uh, uh, outside linebacker here. Um, Olden Smith. We haven't picked him up for the Raiders because I don't want to replace Max Crosby. I think I might add him a little later on, maybe when the prices come down a little bit. I do think it's cool. I mean, obviously he's gonna have like 81 speed and then um, Max Crosby has 83 speed, which is sick. So like, I love that a couple of speeds is coming off the edge there. Um, really good power move and finesse move. Um, has some up force factor a little bit. Now, one of the best middle linebackers in the game from a user perspective with 88 speed, powered up 89, 91 just with theme team before he put Sprinter on him, 91 speed. Really good Jerome Baker for the Dolphins as well. Brandon Graham, I was a bit disappointed with the speed on this one. He's normally a bit faster, right? But I guess as he gets towards 99, he'll go over the 80 speed mark. Calvin Ridley, very fast. Very speedy wide receiver here. You got to be loving that. Maybe potentially even like 96 speed on some really pimped out teams. Uh, Fred Warner, a little too slow for me. 82 speed. Uh, Blake Martinez, 83 speed as well. Miles Jack, 86. Really want to check out the coverage stats on him. I like the speed. Obviously, as a mop force factor, plays well as well. Now, Marcus May, who went over in the trade for Adams. Love the 90 speed. Love the high zone coverage as well. Uh, Duron Harmon came from the Pats originally, right? 
solid zone coverage, right? Really good solid zone coverage and play rec. Really good speed, really good height as well. Um, Alan Lazard, who got injured, that's sad for him, but 6'5", 89 speed. My rugs at 91 speed is still taking the top off of some god-tier defenses. So this dude right here is going to be an absolute baller, man. Uh, Shaq Thompson, good speed. Again, at middle linebacker, solid enough there. Really, really like him. Uh, Edelman, safe hands, not fast enough for me, though. Derek Carr gets hot route master. And we'll show you him as we end the video here. Crazy good throw power at 95 throw power on my Raiders steam team. Uh, Johnson, a little too slow for me. It's strong safety there. Um, a little too slow. Now, that's more like it. 89 speed. Getting up over 90 speed at safety is what you want right there. On a theme team, though, definitely good enough, man. I'm getting away with McKinney with uh, 87 speed at free safety. Usering him as well. Some clutch plays. Kamara, good on the speed. Great to see. Solid catching. Could be even better. DK Metcalf, though. 97 speed on some theme teams? Holy crap, guys. This is the guy I actually kind of want to get in my lineup and have some fun with. Even just at 93 speed to get him in the lineup and be bombing bombing to him instead of rugs, maybe. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see, guys. He's fast, man. Mike Hilton, solid enough coverage and speed on a theme team, but very short. And that, that height is really showing up this year. Um, my uh, uh, Nevin Lawson is getting destroyed by taller receivers. Um, middle linebacker, too slow. Uh, McKinney right there. Uh, Vaccaro, uh, just getting away with him at, on a theme team. Good hit power, lousy coverage though. Very weird card. Very weird stats on him. Kendricks, one of the biggest... Man, disappointment cards right here. You know, they really wanted what? Uh, the, the, the wide receiver Jefferson, right? 81 speed, a middle linebacker. Good Lord. Bostic played for about 20 teams as well. Solid. Solid option right here. I dig it. I like the Bostic card. All right, now let's get over and show you... Uh, what derelict looks like um pretty pretty stoked actually pretty happy with this just sh shutting down the chrome guys have a look at derek right here oh yeah very very nice wait to see these stats have a look man have a look right here 81 speed 95 throw power the short accuracy threshold, I think, is only 80, so he's well and truly got that. Medium is 85, so that's good. The deep is 88, and I got to tell you, man, throwing to pressure didn't show up yet, but in, in the game we played, I got really ragey on stream because we spent like an hour unlocking Derek, and then we go to play with him, and I lag four seconds, and we can't even show off the throwing. But I, I tell you what, in the second game we did, the ball is humming out of this guy's hands it's absolutely zinging so brett Favre, josh allen um these guys that get up over 95 throw power i think there's like a magical threshold there i gotta tell you it's night and day compared to rich gannon so i'm gonna be rolling with derek for a while does get hot route master i chose not to put him put it on him um but you can put it on him right there if you need to we, we went quick draw tied out and pocket dead eye really enjoying him already even though the games were laggy let's go raider nation wearing my Derek carr jersey happy friday mates the 50 looks really sick let me know in the comment section if you're happy with your additions today and of course let's give me some legend predictions down below as well thanks for watching mates happy friday see you soon remember sub like leave a comment tell a friend sub giveaways coming soon oh yeah right there right is